Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Okay, first of all, if you are a returning subscriber or a returning member, okay, I want to thank you so much for returning and viewing my channel and watching my videos, okay, because you guys are so supportive and I really do appreciate that my channel ended up on the good side of YouTube because I have some of the best comments, some of the best people coming to my channel. Now, yes, you may have the one or two uh, people that may get lost to come over here with the little comments, with the little ink, 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 ink type of comments, and I just send them politely over to the block department, and all is well again, okay? So, if you're new here, though, I want to thank you so much for joining us today. Come on in. Have a seat. Have a seat, honey. You're so welcome to, to come to come over, don't break nothing, just come in and have a seat, okay? Because if you're wondering, why am I here? How did I get here? Well, I'll tell you how, okay? YouTube, my friends at YouTube found that you are interested in something that we are talking about over here. And they decided to recommend you the video. And you decided to click and you're here. And guess what? You're gonna be happy you came, okay? Because, and but if you're wondering now, what okay, now that I'm here, what do you do? Well, I take these beautiful tarot cards right here or oracle cards and I use them, okay, as a tool to pretty much read the energy of the room. Pretty much, whoever we're reading on for the day, whether it's your favorite artist, your favorite rapper, your favorite movie star or hey even you okay i will read you okay and i use a whole spiritual team okay my ancestors my uh spirit guides my i have a whole team okay we we, we tight we tight okay so um so we come over and we use spirituality to pretty much read the energy of your favorite artist or the training topics and do a little entertainment in, in between hopefully you get a message from um each video okay yeah i mean i try to be silly sometimes i mean i'm here to entertain you honey i'm here to perform but at the end of the day we are reading on real people we are reading on um and and when i say reading we're reading on we're using good energy and good spirit, okay? So don't come over here with negativity. Don't come over here saying anything that we're doing is negative, which are negative comments, okay? So we make sure we're being only positive over here, okay? Now, if the cards speak pot, speak in a, in a certain type of way, then I just have to read it. I just have to be honest with that, okay? But I'm not going to go as so far as to say too much because my cards won't let me say too much. My spirit team won't let me say too much, okay? So let's get started. So today... We're going to be reading on Miss Molly Ray Cyrus, honey. Miss Molly. Miss Molly is a Sagittarius. She was born November the 23rd, 1992. That makes her 29. Okay. Miss Molly. I like Molly. Okay. She had her, she have her little phases. Okay. She'll come out. She do good music. She's a good actor. I mean, she like to have fun. I like that about Molly. But then Molly, you know, she'll go through her phases. You know, I think her teenage acting out phase where we just saw her tongue every day. It's like, Molly, I can't see your tongue no more, baby. Not, I can't see your tongue another day. Okay, but then she got tired. She went and took a nap. Okay, we ain't seen her for a minute. And now she back. Okay, but I'm sure she's training for something good, like her music or something like that. But we're going to find out what's the energy for Miss Molly Cyrus. Okay, let's jump in there. I already wasted enough time. Okay, let's jump straight in. We got the Fairy Bee. My life is sweet. Okay. Come through, Miss Molly. So, Molly's saying her life is sweet right now. Okay. Everything is sweet about her. So, that means we're going to get the good Molly. Okay. Molly is out and ready to be productive. She's happy. Okay. she. We, that means we won't see the tongue. We won't see the tongue this time. Hopefully. Okay. So, she's saying her life is sweet. So, um, she's out and ready to celebrate that. Okay. She said, I am reborn. Okay. 
See, y'all was judging Molly. Okay, y'all was judging Molly. But Molly said she's been reborn. She's changed her life. She's she's new and improved. Okay. I think I want to set my cards up. Okay. Yeah. So she says she was reborn. She's a the butterfly fairy. Oh. And she may have been reborn from some sadness or some some yeah, because her eyes look very sad right there. So but she was reborn. She took a moment. She went into, on her nap. Like I was just telling y'all, she'd go back and forth on her little naps where we don't hear from her. And and which is good because when she falls back, she's in her little cocoon and she's, you know, coming. She's working on herself. She's healing. And that's beautiful. It said, once upon a midnight dreamy. Okay. Okay. We know, girls, we know when we have that type of look in our eyes, right? Uh oh, we don't got we don't, some 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 boy that got our attention. Okay, it says creativity, genius, writing, expression, artist flow. Okay, so Molly is showing back up as a artist. So she may have got some banging music about to come out, or she got a nice good mute some, a movie about to come out. And because she is ready, she says she's been creative when she's been in her cocoon um, situation over here. Now, she is good. She is inspired. Okay. Back in the day, once upon a time, back in the day, she may have been that Molly that um, we once knew. But she's new and improved now. Okay. She look even calm. She feel, The energy is feeling very calm. And I thought Molly was going to come to the set and be jumping all over the place and knocking stuff over. But no. Molly is calm right now. Okay. We got the two kittens. It says, you must choose. Okay. You must choose what, Molly? What you up to? Okay. Because you look like you was over here being creative, but you got, like, you got that look. You got that look like somebody has caught your eye. Okay. And then we pull the card of two kittens. You must choose, girl. Okay. Now, she truly living her best life. She was not lying about that. Okay. Next, we have the black cat. Uh-oh. Lost magic, atonement, rebalance. Okay, now, Miss Miley, Miss Miley, it's cute that you got two, you got two uh, kittens over there. They cute. Until they start fighting, until they start wanting your attention. Okay, it's adorable until things go wrong. And then, they say, you know, you're licking your tongue out in every picture. Okay, we, we don't want to go back to that. Okay, so, we need you to stay balanced. Okay, because you're saying that you need to rebalance. We need you to stay balanced. Because we got the golden phoenix here. Something you thought finished burst back into your life. Uh-oh. Man, who not show back up? Who was she dating before? That little cute guy. Somebody okay, now, now it so it's not Molly's fault. So she had one kitten. Okay, she fell in love with one kitten. Okay. Cute, okay. He he, you know, kind of stole her heart a little bit. She was ready. You, you know how ex boyfriends do. As soon as you're ready to get over him, you're completely over him, and you're ready to move on. He pop in just enough, you know, just um soon enough, just to kind of still grab a little bit of that attention that he's that you still have in your heart for him. Okay, so it seemed like that's what's happening here. We got two kittens. Okay, she don't know which one to put down, and one is looking like I was here first. And then the other one's like, well, I was here the longest. And then the other one, but one don't look quite right, Molly. One look like it's up to no good. One look like it's just there because it just want to have its place back. So, girl, watch out, Miss Molly. Okay, so we got the, um, now you are independent and free. It's like, girl, whoever you don't let go in your past, okay, they had you licking your tongue out and acting up. Okay, in all your photos, you finally got that person out of your energy, girl. Let's keep them out, okay? Don't fall in love with those eyes again, girl. Do not, do not look in those eyes, okay? Look away. Because now you're independent and free. Now it's time for you to move forward. Girl, let's find the energy. Let's find the energy, Miss Molly. About these two kittens now. Why you got these two kittens up here? Okay. Because one kid got, well, one kid got, look like it got different type of attentions. 
give us more about this two kings. All right. We got the golden mirror. Self-absorbed, narcissist, one-sided relationship, love bombing. I cannot make this up. Love bombing, okay? I knew one of these cats was up no good. It's you. I'm going to put this card right by that, by you. But you starting to look a little, spook, little spooky to me, too. Okay, you starting to look a little... But that could be just y'all cat eyes, okay? I'm going I'm to I'm excuse that. But it says palm tree. Because we need stability, security, performance, growth, endurance, and flexibility. Okay. So one cat. Okay, so even though they both got cat eyes, okay, it look past the cat eyes, look past the eyes. I tell you, Molly, ignore the eyes, okay, okay, because it says right now, one cat is self-absorbed, okay, one may be a narcissist, okay. If if you go with this cat over here, it's gonna be a one-sided relationship. He just there to just try to love bomb and try to get in the picture of you and your little cat that's on the other side. You and your little cat looking cute in your Instagram pictures. You and your and then here he come. Okay, because this cat over here is giving you more stability, security, performance, growth, and, you know, and you need that. Girl, make wise decisions. We got the black cat over here, okay, because it looks like she may not have made a wise decision because the black cat showed up. <laughs> okay, she took one of the cats to the salon. So let's find out why is the black cat here. Okay, we got girl talk, time with your friends, moving on, happily single. Okay, you know how we do, y'all. Do we be really happily single? We be, first, we, we fake it till we make it. And then we can, then we'll eventually start moving on. And But it's like living in the moment, having fun with her black cat, okay? So she made a decision. This could be past energy. Okay, but you know how that you know how those paths like to creep in on you, honey. So we got the golden phoenix here. It's some, it says something you thought was finished burst back into your life. See, she can't let it go. So let's find out about that. See, this person coming in wrecking stuff already, knocking stuff over. Cause we got the clock here. Needs time. Take time. And time. Hmm. Take time in time. Cycles. Time to heal. Progress. Okay, so she in the healing process over here. Healing process from this cat that just wanted to pop into the picture. Yes, and I mean cat like sleep just just kind of like creep in with the cupid arrows. Have faith. Love is coming, girl. Surprise. Invitation or meeting. But there's going to be some hesitation because she's tired of getting hurt. But there's some engagement ring. Okay. Is she engaged? There's an engagement, a partnership, a commitment. Eternity complete. Completion, a union. Get it, girl. See, this is a whole cycle. You see? This is a whole cycle. Because, look here, life is sweet, life is good, right? You good, you know what I mean? You looking beautiful, you got the best body you ever had. I mean, making money, okay? And then here come, and then, so, and then you have this rebirth, okay? Feeling good, everything's great. Being creative, falling in love with someone, okay? Here come this boy, okay? Meet this good guy. Here come an ex. This ex that you just can't quite shake, but you should. He comes in. And not only did he come in, but he stirs things up. And you go from having this little nice little um, sweet little cat to now you and your cat both done dyed your hair. Okay? I can't make this up. Okay, knock it off because he raking stuff anyway. So, yeah. You got your, your nice little blonde hair. You know, and then Molly. Okay, because she'll change her hairstyle in a minute. And then he get her to the point that she's changed her hair. Then changed the cat hair. You know you don't went too far. Because she tried to get some balance, okay? And then as soon as she get balanced, guess what? Something from your past come right back in. But we got the Cupid Eros and the engagement ring here. Honey, it's not about to get married. 
Let me find out. I'm going to pull from this card. So, let's see. Tell us more about this Cupid arrow. Hmm. All right, let's see. Well played, breadcrumbing. Yeah, don't trust him. Don't trust this dude. Okay, because he coming in to play game. He's still love bombing. Avoid this, avoid this person, Molly, at all costs, okay? Because he coming in, he's going to be breadcrumbing. Okay, he probably coming in. I love you. Remember when we were married? I want to marry you now. No, he, no, he does not. Okay, because he's going to come in breadcrumbing you like he did before. Whoever he is. Okay, give us more about this engagement. Ring. Okay, we got filters. Honey, why would you... you he going to put filters on engagement ring because he fake. Mood. The topic is, okay. It says the topic or how you're feeling is relatable to them. Okay. Understandable. A completion of you. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Whole vibe. Okay. So, it looks like Molly picking up on this energy. Of this person. She's feeling his energy. She ain't playing. She ain't. You know. He can try to sugarcoat it all he wants to. But I think she sees it. Okay. And she's going to go with the better option. Because they say things are not what they appear, honey. It's some filters. And he put the worst filters. I mean, purple. I like purple. But come on. That's too dark. So let's see here. Since we're talking about love here, give us the overall energy of Miley's current love life. Okay, why is so much? Let's put this. Okay. Give us some energy of Miley's love life. Like what? Okay. Girl. Love yourself first. Put both of the cats down. You're allergic in a way. Look at your eyes watering. Put both of the cats down, sweetie. Okay? It says love yourself first. Okay? Your, your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive, which means you'll attract a better type of cat. Okay? Literally. Okay? Because there's some... Girl, there's some deception here. See? These cards right here going to speak the truth whether you want to hear it or not. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. Okay. One of your cats are lying. Which one? I say that one. But then the cards say, I love yourself first. And then you'll know. Let's pull some more. Okay. Because... Worth waiting for, honey. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Yeah, baby. Just have fun with those cats, okay? Play with them. You know, throw them the ball. Whatever you do with cats, honey. Play with them a little bit. And then send them on their way. Okay, whatever you do, don't give them the milk. Do not give them the milk. But, yeah, you can, you can throw them the ball and let them play with the yarn. Okay? But don't, don't give them the milk. Let them go about their way because you can't trust them. Okay? You got it, Molly? Let's see. Is there anything else that we can pull from Miss Molly? I think that's going to... Let me see. Let's see. Can we get a description of this of this cat? Okay. Let's see. Okay. Can you give us a description of the, 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 um, the cat that's wearing the, the mask, please? description of the cat wearing the mask. The cat in the mask. I just give us a description of the cat in the mask. That's deceiving Miley Cyrus. Okay. Clearly somebody she likes she used to travel with or she may even travel to go see. With the travel card. Somebody that lives at a, at a distance. Okay. Honey, somebody that gave her nothing but hell. Karma. Straight karma. Oh, she know who this person is. Okay. 
somebody that's straight karma. So this person is not good from her. Somebody definitely from her past, for sure. Okay, because with the golden phoenix, it is something you thought finished burst right back into your life. Somebody from your past life, honey. It's definitely a past boyfriend, a past somebody that you thought that was your destiny. Okay. Somebody that probably stopped your destiny as well. Blocked your destiny. Could have very well been that person. So there's a couple more cards of this person. This this person that's wearing the false mask in Miley's life. Mm. A young male. Somebody who thinks they're so cool. Dropping the top on the car, honey. Always pulling up, trying to look cool. Okay, dark hair. Look at him. Who he look like? My divine team ain't lying. Who he look like? Okay. Sure. Dark hair, pretty eyes. Give us some more cards. Give us some more cards of this person. One more. Of this person that's wearing a false mask, that's photo bombing, that's coming in, trying to come in from the past. Offering something. Okay. Yeah. A mature male. Maybe somebody that's... Because mature male. But he's saying he mature now. Is Are you? Okay. Or... Okay. So we got... So it looks like probably both cats. You probably got older cat and younger cat. Because both of her cats... I think both of her cats are trifling. <laughs> she ain't got no good cat. In her in the litter. It was more about this young male. Okay. It was more about this young male. What can you talk about this young male? Okay. Marriage. Someone that she was in the marriage with, someone that she wants married, someone that she's married to, someone that she planned to marry to, get married to. This young male was somebody that was important to her, honey. He may even be offering marriage now. What else can you tell us about this young male? Okay. Okay, so this young male, mature male. They say he's mature now, honey. He's older, he's mature. And he may even be ready for marriage now. Or fame. <laughs> Occupation. Tell me more about this mature male. Are they one and the same? Expectations. There's some expectations here with this mature male. Okay? With this person in this mature state, um, Miley has expectations for them. Okay? Yeah, this is still talking about traveling. Someone that's at a distance from her. Maybe someone that's not even, you know, that she may not be 100% connected to right now. They're not in the same location. We got a main male. Okay, yeah. It's, a, it's definitely a male here. Okay, this male, you know, he may be wearing a, a mask, but she really needs to just focus on herself. Because either we got two males here, a young male that's mature now, and he's trying to tell her I'm more mature. But he really ain't because he's wearing a false mask. Or we have, and he lying about because I was asking about um, the, the false mask. And he's, but he's saying he's more mature now. He may be lying. But he wants to be the main male. He may even be trying to now say, you know, I'll move to where you are. Okay. Okay, he trying to step up his game. Okay. Let's just pull one more card about this main male. What else can you tell us about this main male? A new romantic cycle. Okay, yeah, he wants a new beginning. A new romantic cycle begins.
Okay, but it's gonna be just a heartache if she don't love herself first. Hopefully, she's done that because it's showing that she did. She has, you know, she's been reborn. You know, so it's time to release any negativity. Okay, like who being negative here? He's the one that's wearing the false mask. So, but it's time to release any negativity right now. It's a new moon, new moon cycle. Time for new beginnings. Okay. So pretty much just meditate and contemplate on what you want so that it can clearly come to you. Okay. While we're in this new moon cycle. Okay. With Libra, Scorpio, and Pisces. All right. That's going to conclude the reading for Molly, honey. Molly got two cats right now. Okay. Two cats are buying for her attention. She got to make a decision which one she's going to pick. Because it's looking like it could end in marriage with one of them. But she got to love herself first so she can make that final decision on which cat is the best cat for Molly. So this ended up being a love reading. A love reading for herself. And once she learns to love herself, true love will show itself to her or she will see it. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that reading. Stay tuned for the next reading. Okay, I might be doing a reading on this cat. Okay. So, stay tuned for that, okay? Talk to you later. Bye.